Hi, I'm Carl Schultz, President of Packline Corporation and Packline Conveyors, Inc. Today I'd like to introduce you to the full range of Packline's overhead conveyor products. On this display rack behind me, I have three styles of synchronous conveyor. Synchronous conveyor means that all the loads attached to the chain will move at the same pace. If you stop the conveyor, all loads will stop. If you start the conveyor, all will start. That's not to be confused with non-synchronous conveyors, such as these two. Um, in synchronous conveyors, there are basically two different styles. There's enclosed track, which Packline is famous for, and then there's open track. Um, enclosed track conveyors have a bit of an advantage over uh, other conveyors in that they're very safe. So if this conveyor was running, I could actually touch the track without any danger of getting my fingers uh, caught in the mechanisms. On an open track conveyor, you can see that these bearings are all exposed. If I was to put my finger in here, I would probably lose it. The other advantage is that uh, in applications such as paint spraying, the overspray will eventually make its way onto the track as opposed to inside on the bearings and the chain. On an open track style, the overspray will hit those components and eventually it will fall off uh, and cause a defect on the products that, it's being, that are being conveyed. Um, it's very simple. On an, on an enclosed track uh, overhead conveyor like this, we have a chain running inside this tube. Um, on an open track conveyor, you have number of trolleys that are driven by it, pulled by a chain and the load will be attached below. These two conveyors are non-synchronous which basically means that uh, the loads that are hanging from this can work at different, can be conveying at different paces and they can actually uh, stop and go uh, independently of each other and uh, can actually switch tracks. This is called a power and free conveyor. So it's so named because on the top we have something similar to an enclosed track conveyor running continuously. So this chain is running continuously. The only thing that's hanging down from it is a drive dog. Underneath it is another set of tracks called the free tracks. Inside the free tracks are trolleys. These are free to roll back and forth. And only when engaged with this driving dog will they be pushed along. So if I had to stop this trolley and the load beneath it, I would I have a device that allows these flippers to move out of the way and now the drive dog would pass right over top. In other words, that, now, that trolley is now free. So that's where the name comes, power and free. A uh, number of our conveyors are invertible. The C250 is not an invertible conveyor. The PacMax conveyor is. This can run in any orientation. It can run with the slot sideways or the slot uh, facing up. Uh, this is particularly useful when you have a very high quality finishing system where you want the load above the conveyor. There, thereby, there is no chance of any kind of uh, oil or uh, debris from on top of the track from hitting your product. Um, in the power and free non-synchronous conveyors, uh, both of these models are invertible. They have spring-loaded trolley flippers, which allows this to happen. Um, once again, for cleanliness reasons, you'd want to do this. Uh, you can also do what's called over-under conveyors, where the, the track actually uh, loops in a vertical uh, plane. Very useful uh, if, you have, uh, if you're lacking floor space in a particular work cell. In terms of capacities, in our synchronous conveyor lines, capacity of 50 pounds per hanging point, but if you use a load bar arrangement and distribute the load over multiple points, you could have a 100 pound capacity or even 200 pounds with a four pendant load bar arrangement. The same holds true for our other conveyors. The PacMax conveyor has a single point hanging capacity of 220 pounds with a single uh, a two pendant load bar that's 440 pounds and with a four pendant load bar that's 880 pounds. When you get to these higher capacities you'll want to make sure that your track is supported properly. So more support points. 
The, uh, the open track I-beam conveyor down below uh, comes in three different capacities. It's not invertible. Uh, this, this is a three inch I-beam that we're showing here. It comes in a four inch variety and, and, a, and a six inch variety. The three inch has a capacity of 200 pounds a hanging point. The four inch has a capacity of 400 pounds per hanging point. And the six inch has a capacity of 1200 pounds per hanging point. The six inch is what you would typically see in a car plant carrying an entire car. So that is our product range. And uh, if you were to call in one of our engineers, they are likely to select from one of these five conveyors uh, according to function and capacity. Thank you.